Greetings humanoids of the internets. My name is Bob and this may be my one and only uh, video blog uh, but I figured I'd experiment with it. What the fuck? Um, uh, now a lot of people are wondering what, what's up with my KSP videos uh, and what's up with them is that I'm a little bit bored with KSP right now. Um, okay, the things to do in KSP as far as planets go is go to planets, orbit planets, look at how cool they look, which they do look very cool, uh, and land on planets. But there's not much to do after that. Uh, so I'm hoping they get resources in pretty quick, because uh, that would be cool. Or maybe some science to do when you get to the planets would be cool. Uh, but uh, until then, it doesn't capture my imagination, and other things are capturing my imagination. Uh, so that's that. Uh, and um, so I'm sorry if you're not getting KSP videos, but I'm not, not just a KSP whore. I'm, you know, I, I play what I want to play, and if you guys want to tag along for the ride, that's cool. So, um, let's see what else. Uh, Planet Explorers. Um, there are a couple things I want, or at least one thing I want to do further in Planet Explorers. I uh, hope we get some uh, updates out. Cool, because it was soon, but because it's a very cool game, I really enjoy it. Um, but as far as videos go, there's one or two things I want to do. Uh, not really seeing much beyond that. Uh, of course, you never know. And again, with KSP, I might, um, you know, might get a wild hair to do something. You know, uh, the thing is that that um, journeys to planets uh, take a long time. Uh, and uh, so probably if I do a lot, you know, do 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 KSP between now and the next update, uh, it's probably going to be stuff close to home uh, because uh, going to planets takes a while. Uh, have some ideas that might take me to, to planets, uh, but uh, right now there's nothing you could nothing you could really do there. Uh, so hoping that they get resources soon. Uh, Sim City. Um, I'm still looking for somebody to um, uh, to play Sim City with me, uh, except for my uh, weekly news of the weird uh, world or weird or whatever the hell it was that I'm, I'm doing uh, with my little disaster clips. I don't really see much um, going on with Sim City. Aside from those, uh, and that, that's just, you know, I play SimCity and something weird happens and I go, oh, start recording. Um, so that's SimCity. Uh, and let's see what else. Battlefield. Uh, I'm, I'm, I didn't like my experience with Battlefield 3. Uh, it's not, I mean, I, I'm very, very much uh, interested in open world games. Uh, don't like feeling like I'm, I'm railroaded to a particular direction. That was my primary grief with uh, Far Cry 3, uh, which is you. I felt like uh, that uh, you're rail railroaded in uh, to a particular direction, and also they have those stupid little mini games where you like press space or press B a whole bunch of times. Um, I hated that, and they had that in Battlefield 3 too, or at least in the campaign mode. Uh, so I was not pleased with that. I may try like a quick play or something, or on uh, online playing against people, possibly, um, depending on how bored I get. Um, let's see what else is going on. <coughs> uh, if you're not on the uh, Journey Into Space Facebook group um, uh, and want to keep up with what weird things I keep up with, um, it, it's a good idea to join because um, uh, all sorts of space interests um, that I'm interested in, uh, totally aside from KSP, uh, I post links there to what, I, what I'm interested in. Uh, and things I'm interested in uh, right now are precisely the things that KSP doesn't have. Uh, the most interesting things going on in space right now uh, is um, uh, resources. You know, uh, going going to uh, in situ resource re utilization is what it's called. Going to places and using the resources resources to uh, both uh, expand where you can go in space uh, and expand the um, uh, the uh, how should I say it? Expand the uh, financial worthiness. Uh, what, what word am I looking for? Um, expand, expand the financial motivation for people to go to space. If you bring back a, a rock full of platinum and gold from the asteroids, and it doesn't take you that much money to, to get to get it back, you know that's that's a big financial motivation. Platinum is not cheap. Neither is gold. Neither is uh, you know a bunch of other stuff that the Earth doesn't have much of, uh, but which um, there's plenty of in asteroids. Um, in the Earth, uh, all the heavy stuff like platinum, grip metals, gold, you know. 
other stuff that's of fantastic interest to us um, from the viewpoint of making electronics and so on, a lot of that stuff sank to the center of the earth when it was formed. And so, for instance, most of the gold, most of the platinum group metals that we have now on the earth were put there by asteroids. I mean, the, the, the stuff that was there here originally sank to the center of the earth. Um, so, um, anyway, uh, precisely the, the parts of space exploration that I find most interesting right now is precisely the part that KSB doesn't have. Uh, they don't have resources. Um, I would like to, of course, uh, they've, they've done such an amazing thing so far. It's kind of, kind of bitchy to say, well, they need to do this, this, and this. But um, it would be nice if they had opportunities for science, and especially, which they will have for sure, uh, opportunities for uh, in-situ resource utilization. Uh, so that's that. Um, what else am I doing? Um, let's see. I have another, uh, a number of other bizarre interests uh, besides uh, uh, space stuff. Um, I don't really have a venue for talking about that sort of stuff or an audience who's interested in hearing about it, you know. And for most of that stuff, I'm, I'm really uh, in the position of the learner, you know, myself. I'm, I'm, I'm going around and going, wow, that's cool. Check that shit out. Uh, so I'm, I'm not, uh, I'm not in a position of, of. Um, teaching anyone these things. I'm, I'm in a position of being intensely interested in things. Um, I'm a very curious person. And um, you will... Ah, bugs! I'm very bug-phobic. <laughs> bugs! Bugs! Uh, uh, where was I? Um, yeah. Um... And you'll find out that I'm, I'm a fairly um, intellectual-centric person. Uh, I don't have a wife, girlfriend, cat, dog, goldfish. I don't have any of these things. I'm not sure I even want those things, you know. Uh, so uh, you will find that I'm a, a fairly, uh, in my off-gaming time, I'm a fairly um, intellectually-centered person. I'm interested in, in weird stuff that goes on in the, in the universe, you know. So, let's see. And a lot of those things are, are not really stuff that's uh, all that uh, appropriate in a gaming video context. So, um, so I'll, I'll, I'll figure some, some, some way of satisfying those, those parts of my uh, uh, video filming potential at some po other point. Bugs. God damn it! Fucking bugs! Okay, well, the bees probably won't let us finish this. Uh, let's see. What else? What else am I doing? Hmm. Uh, let's see. I guess that's all for right now. Um, it seems like there should be something more that I should be talking about. You just make funny faces. Okay, I think that's all for now. Uh, and until next time, uh, <laughs> I always like to get these little little signature bits in, you know, like uh, greetings humanoids of the internet, or uh, until next time, hasta la vista. Adios. Also, if you have any uh, bizarre interest in actually seeing more of these um, vlogs, um, you know, leave a comment. Because left to my own devices, I might not ever make any more of them. If you're really interested in hearing this shit, then leave a comment, uh, and I will make more of them. Alrighty? Thanks. Goodbye.